dungeon. And Varax, you're going to pick up these. Oh. Huh. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I shouldn't have given that to him. Oh, and... Yeah, infravision, infravision, but that is useless. It is certain that the death of Malahe will relieve the fears of the terrorized folk of Nashkem. But you remain uneasy. While the half-orc may indeed have caused the evils that befell the mine, the shortage of iron is too widespread to be his doing alone. His letters confirm your suspicions, and though they give little indication as to where his cohorts are hiding, they may have links to the bandits that currently plague the coast way. Alright, we're in chapter 3 now. Let's read these notes. My servant Mullahay, your progress in disrupting the flow of iron does not go as well as it should. How stupid can you be to allow your cobalts to murder the miners? With your presence revealed, you should be wary of enemies sent to stop your operation. Your task is a very simple one. If you continue to show that you can't do the job, you will be replaced. Ah, so this is why he thought that we were there to kill him. Uh, I will not send the cobalt you have requested, and I need more all the troops I possess to stop the flow of iron in this region. With these messages, I have... Uh, send more of the mineral poison that you require. If you have any problems, then send me a message uh, to my new contact in Beragost. His name is Transig. He'll be staying at Phil Posts Inn, Feldy Posts Inn. So that's where we're heading next. Um, as far as the quest goes, we're going back to uh, Beragost to talk to this Transig in Feldy Posts Inn. What's this other one? Uh, my seventh miller here. I've sent you the cobalt and mineral poison uh, that you require. This is from before the last letter then. Uh, your task is to poison any iron ore that leaves the mine. Don't reveal your presence to the miners, you will find yourself swamped by soldiers from the local Amish garrison. My superiors have recently hired um, on the service of the Black Talon mercenaries in the Chill. Uh, with these soldiers at my disposal, I should be able to destroy any iron caravans entering the region from the south and east. I don't want to deal with iron coming from the Nashville mines, so don't feel in your duty. So this Tazic character has hired Black Talon mercenaries in the chill, I think chill are hobgoblins, um, to deal with the the iron caravans. We don't know why this Tazic is trying to do all this though, but we might find it from his contact in Beragost. Perhaps. Maybe. <laughs> we don't know though. Anyway, give these to Imwen. A little bit of inventory sorting never hurt anyone, eh? Yes, yes, give you that. That belongs to you. I don't know why I never give my fighters anything to carry. Because I should. An antidote. Yeah, that's useful. Um, it's a potion of absorption, so it does... Oh, wait a minute. Electrical, electrical resistance 100%, it does bonus against crushing attacks. Neat. Oh, yes. Alright, I think we're about done now. A couple more scrolls for the scroll case. Put those there. Alright, how much? You got 266, you got 257. Okay, so we're good for... Um, bullets. Oh, the Moonblade. This portal weapon is created by the Smiths of Myth Draenor. And this particular sword is chosen by the elf Zan. So, this is going to be used by, by Zan. Who the hell is Zan? It's a pretty damn nice sword. You can only use by one NPC though, who happens to be here. Zan is the most depressing person in the world. I thank you for my freedom, friends, for I have languished in these dismal vaults too long. Five and eight days are far too long for one of the fair folk to live as a dwarf. You look no better off than I, but my appreciation for the, for the liberty bids me uh, to aid my spells to your cause. So he can join us. He's an NPC that can join us. He's a, a mage, an enchanter, I believe. Uh, not the best kind of mage. I don't think you can even cast magic missile with him, uh, which is kind of an essential spell. Um, and he's depressing as hell. He does have that nice sword, but why would you put a mage in melee? I don't know. Uh, 
I'd rather he didn't join us. But we'd lost not so we gave him we gave him the um sword back. I guess purely because we didn't want to carry it. Although hey, you know, we didn't get a choice in that matter, did we? Hmm. More inventory stuff. More inventory stuff. Okay, it's all good. Alright, let's get out of here. No no wait a minute. Anything up here? What 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 the hell? That was a bit below the belt, wasn't it? Anyway, no, there is nothing else here. Sweet, let's let's leave. Now, if we go around here, we should find another way out, which might lead us to an entirely different, new, exciting, wonderful, joyous area. And maybe some more enemies up here. Maybe. Yeah, maybe not. Yeah. All right. What the hell is that? It's a great ooze. Holy hell! Not quite sure about these things, like. At least we can hurt them. Stop attacking Minsk, he's almost dead. I'd rather not Minsk die, honestly. 275 experience each for those. Yeah, and then we can leave. <coughs> so let's, uh, yes. Let's do that. Is that you, Boo? <laughs> it's Kagan. <laughs> oh, it's calling me stupid. <laughs> and with good reason. <laughs> okay. Where the hell are we? New area. So this is a minor... I'm not... Maybe we can go back down there. Maybe we could have gone down there in the first place. I don't know. I'm not going to try though. Uh, but we are... Where are we? Oh yeah, there. We're all the way out here, which could be now an excuse to get slightly waylaid and go maybe north and east and cover some of this because there's um there's a quest for the for for Beragost for uh, some half ogres wasn't it for for a knight who got trampled by them pretty much to go around here. So when we get back to Beragost, we could do that and then maybe head like around here or somehow. Um, but yeah, so for now, what we're going to do is we're going to head there, there, and there. As well as do this bit, obviously. Um, save! Even though it just saved. I always feel better when I press the quick slave. It's good. Good. Knolls! We can deal with them easy enough. I say, and then we just fail at killing them completely. Come on! Come on, there we go. Now we get in there now. There we get in there, there we go. Well done, everyone. Well done. Yeah. 11 grand now. We can't be that far, because we got another um, reputation point recently, so we, we disliked six. So. Mm, we should get another reputation point for clearing the mines out. So that makes seven. Maybe we might get back onto kind of neutral kind of settings, which is uh, preferable.
Because I don't want to be too popular in the game. Of course, being neutral just means that uh, things effectively cost the most for you in uh, in shops and that. Oh, hello! 